Oh, you can do chores for people and get rewarded. That's very nice of you to do as the spawn of Satan. I mean, I'm assuming that you're the spawn of Satan in this game. If if the story of this game is just you being some piece of shit kid who is just horrible and he just goes around and murders people, like, it's not really as interesting of a story. I think you'd have to be the spawn of Satan for this story to really make sense and be worthwhile. Oh, okay, we'll get some explanation here, it looks like. What is going on here? Am I already the kid? Looking in on everybody? It's time to blow out the candles. Remember to make a wish, honey. Oh no, oh wow, he, That's my boy. he looks like the fucking spawn of Satan. Mary, could you please clean up? Lucius can help you with the dishes. He can stay up later this evening to play with his new toys, but in bed no later than ten. Yes, ma'am. Oh, she sounds evil, too. She looks like she could be a demonic. Lucius. Jesus, my eyes and my nostrils are just vibrating like crazy. I guess my lips are, too. Oh, you can hear the demons whispering to me. Am I hallucinating that guy that's standing there smiling at me? Yeah. Huh, a lock. Oh! Oh! How do I lock? Lock her in! You are now trapped in the freezer with all of the cold. It's not cold enough. Oh shit. Hello. Oh, you know <laughs> they go to slow motion. Just to fucking make a point of him not giving a fuck. He may as well have just been walking away from an explosion. It would have had the exact same effect. <laughs> Is that like my messenger bird from hell? What the fuck is going on out there? Did I wake up in hell? <laughs> oh yeah, there's my dad. I've come to speak to you about your calling, my boy. My Each boy. You will make you big and mighty. It's a simple thing to do, Lucius. You can influence your future and become a master overall. That's cool, Dad. I just want my teddy bear journal. Am I missing something here? What, what the fuck is going on, huh? Why am I talking like this? Awesome. You'll need this notebook. It will help you on your <laughs> journey. So, the devil brought me a goddamn teddy bear notebook with stars and rainbows on it, and the teddy bear is holding a pencil. That's pretty fucking cool, I guess. It's pretty demonic. A flashlight. This will help you find your way around at night. He talks Pick up your new toys very strangely. Go ahead. Pick up your new toys. See if they work. That's kind of like a try-hard fucking devil right there. You're trying way too hard to be the devil, man. That shit should just come to you. Such a bright boy. <laughs> Thanks. Oh my god, he's got now horns! You need in the kitchen. You left the lock on the freezer door. You will need to get that padlock, Lucius. Otherwise, they will discover you. Oh, man. He's got such a stupid, big, goofy and grin on his face. You wouldn't want that to happen. No. I, I wouldn't want that to happen. Before the adults wake up. Before the adults wake up. Oh, you'd better be careful when walking around the house. Cause I'm the devil, and this is how I talk for some- Okay, that's not really how I sound anymore. I kinda lost it. I'm just gonna carry this around with me, cause I can't seem to figure out how to drop it right now. So, I'm running around with a ball, and I'm the son of Satan. Oh man, this is like a fucking a horror movie looking hallway right here, man. Ooh, I can grab the screwdriver, I can fucking do all this stuff. I've got all the stuff! I've got all the tools and the screwdrivers in the world! I've got a beach ball, so I can have a beach blast. 
with demons and shit. I'm like close to where I need to be. It says that it's right here, actually. I don't, I don't really see anything. Oh yeah, I have a flashlight that I'm just not using because I'm fucking stupid. Alright, yeah. So, that shit's taken care of. I can get back to my ball business. Detective McGuffin. <laughs> what do we got? <laughs> it looks like a cardiac arrest, sir. His the name is Detective McGuffin? Detective McMuffin. Did you talk with the owner of the house? No, sir. They're waiting for you in the kitchen. How can something like this happen, Detective? Was it a seizure of some kind? What? <laughs> we'll look into it, but it looks like a case of misadventure. <laughs> I'd ask that you stay clear of the kitchen and keep staff away while we clean up. <laughs> Just relax and focus on getting life back to normal. Oh my god. Thanks, Detective. We'll try our best. Detective McMuffin is so fucking helpful. Oh, a case of misadventure. That's fucking glorious.